Hi everybody, it's time for Saturday story time. So why don't you get cosy, snuggle up, find your favourite little teddy bear and let's share a story together. Today I've got Bunny, who's one of the favourite teddies in our house. And that's because we love bunnies in this house. And I'm going to read you a story today all about a bunny. And it's called Guess How Much I Love You by Sam McBratney. I love this story, so let's share it together. Why don't you get comfy? The little nut brown hare who was going to bed held on tight to big nut brown hare's very long ears. They really are long ears. He wanted to be sure that big nut brown hare was listening. Guess how much I love you, he said. Oh, I don't think I could guess that, said big nut brown hare. He's pulling on his ears, telling him how much he loves him. I love you this much, said little nut brown hare, stretching out his arms as wide as they could go. Big nut brown hare had even longer arms. But I love you this much, he said. And he stretched his arms out really wide to show how much he loved him. Hmm, that's a lot, thought little nut brown hare. But I wonder if he loves him even more than that. I love you as high as I can reach, said little nut brown hare. Well, that's quite a lot, but it is quite little. I love you as high as I can reach, said big nut brown hare. That is quite high, thought little nut brown hare. I wish I had arms like that. He's only little. He's a little cute bunny. I wonder what else he's going to use to show how much he loves him. Then little nut brown hare had a good idea. He tumbled down and reached up the tree trunk with his feet, standing upside down. I love you all the way up to my toes, he said. And that's quite a lot too. And I love you all the way up to your toes, said big nut brown hare, swinging him up over his head. I love you as high as I can hop, laughed little nut brown hare. Hop, 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 bouncing up and down. But I love you as high as I can hop, smiled big nut brown hare. And he hopped so high that his ears touched the branches above. That's good hopping, thought little nut brown hare. I wish I could hop like that, but he's only little. See, he wouldn't be able to reach this branch. I wonder how he could get as high as that. I love you all the way down the lane as far as the river, cried little nut brown hare. I love you across the river and over the hill, said big nut brown hare. Well, that is a lot. That's very far, thought little nut brown hare. He was almost too sleepy to think any more. And then he looked beyond the thorn bushes out into the big dark night. Nothing could be further away than the sky. Hmm. I wonder what he's thinking's out there. I can see the moon. I love you right up to the moon, he said, and he closed his eyes. Oh, that's far, said Big Nut Brown Hare. That is very far. Big Nut Brown Hare settled little, little Nut Brown Hare into his bed of leaves there, ready to snuggle up. He leaned over and kissed him good night. And then he lay down close by and whispered with a smile, I love you right up to the moon and right back again. That's the end of the story. I bet you love someone as much as that right up to the moon and back. I hope you've enjoyed Saturday story time and have a lovely day. We'll see you again soon for another story time. Bye for now.